and I'm so freaking excited to say that I found an apartment. We just signed. I'm also really excited to show you guys what it looks like because it just has almost everything I want. Despite some negatives about the apartment, they're not that bad. It's a little bit more space than my current one. It has floor to ceiling windows, which is something that I've always wanted. And then it's a loft. So it has this like nice lofted area. And this whole process of getting it was also really annoying. We did have to like bid a little bit, but we did end up getting it, so. That's good. Anyways, I am running a little bit late to dinner. That's okay. It's just with James. Packing's gonna be so annoying. Yeah, just like you. Oh. What do you like most about our new apartment that we're moving into? Ooh. Oh. The really high ceilings. Mm -hmm. The ceilings are so high. I think it's like 16 feet, like, right? Probably a little shorter than I am. paint session but as you can tell I'm not prepared for the weather. I tried to find my umbrella but I have no idea where it went. I'm trying to get to the subway station but it's so far right now. We'll see you guys hopefully at the painting place in a bit. I feel like I always say that I love the shape of my glasses, but I just want to change out the style or I want to make it a different color. And this is the coolest concept ever. So basically with Pear, you can get like a base frame of any style that you pick and that you like. And then you can order these super cool tops to kind of just throw onto a base frame that you have. If you're curious, I got the black base frame, but for the base frame, you can pick any color of many, many options that they have. I picked this green one has a really cool geometric pattern. The next one is just a regular tortoise shell because I love tortoise shell, as you guys know. And then the final one that is probably my favorite is a tortoise shell sunglass frame. 
and this is just for popping onto my glasses so that I can wear them as sunglasses. And let me tell you, their selection is huge. They have 650 top frames that are regular toppers, sunglass toppers, blue light filtering, like prescription, everything. And then also the other cool thing that I noticed when I was on the site is that they do so many collections. There's like a Coca-Cola collection, a Van Gogh collection. They did a collab with Marvel and Harry Potter. So if you guys are interested, you can go to the Pear website and use my code SARAHPAN15 for 15% off your order because these are so freaking cool. Thank you again to Pear for sponsoring this video. Good morning. kind of in a rush right now because I'm heading to a hotel in New York but it's for a conference for creators I'm not sure what to expect uh, I did pack already and I have my tote bag and my room's a mess so please ignore that looking forward to it it's a whole weekend so it'll be pretty fun and the dogs are so cute they're just like on the roof across from me oh kind of reminds me of the German Shepherd that we ran into a couple of weeks ago in Florida. Anyways, I'm gonna head downstairs so I can catch my ride and then we'll be checking in at the hotel and I think there's dinner tonight. So I'm excited for everything and I'll see you guys there. got a covid test and then in my room right now but this is so much wow okay i have to wait 30 minutes for my covid test result made us take that before we can go to the first event i just got my negative covid result and i'm gonna head to dinner now but a quick outfit check my black skirt tube top jacket because it's cold and then these heels i think this is dinner appropriate not too sure it might look a little clubby too oh well i i want you to know and it goes strict but i want you to know that hugh and i had a there's going to be sixty thousand people on the great lawn of central park in new york city for the annual global citizen festival <laughs> <laughs>
the corner of the hotel. I feel like I haven't been documenting very well because I still get kind of shy vlogging around other people, even if they're content creators. And actually I get more shy vlogging around content creators. So yesterday we had this whole summit session with a ton of speakers and I just learned a lot more about sustainability, climate change. Honestly, like a lot of the things I learned were so new to me, but I definitely feel way more motivated to be more proactive and conscious of my actions and like the things that I consume and do and how it contributes to the environment. A few of the statistics that they told us were actually really insane and I never knew this but the amount of water that they use to create chains and burgers blows my mind. And then today we went to this interactive art exhibition called Arcadia Earth in New York City. If any of you guys are in the area definitely go check it out. A lot of installations with pieces made out of trash from the ocean, recycled materials, things like that. Um, and it was really beautiful, really cool, and they also had a whole VR component. My guilt complex is coming out because obviously I'm a consumer of, you know, plastic and meats and things like that, but I'm really glad to be more informed about all of this and I really want to do better. There's not much that I can do in this one vlog, but I do want to leave some resources for climate change, the climate crisis, sustainability, um, down in the description box below. So I highly recommend you guys go check that out and yeah and then today is actually the global citizens festival in central park which i think the jonas brothers are playing metallica is playing and we got vip tickets there which is really fun um and i can't stay for the whole thing which is a little bit sad but i will be there for a little bit of the beginning so i'm really looking forward to that and yeah so that's gonna wrap up my weekend i am so thankful to YouTube for sending me here and also Global Citizens. This was, I like never expected to come on this um, experience, but it's just been really eye-opening and like a really great experience. And yeah, I feel so like appreciative of everything. Um, yeah, and it's been great. Yeah, anyways, I'm like being shy for some reason. <laughs> wanted to thank Global Citizen and YouTube for sending me because this is an amazing weekend. I learned so much about climate change and sustainability. I have to rush to catch my transportation, transportation downstairs, but I will see you guys, I will see you guys soon. <laughs> No, nothing's different, we just called it differently. <laughs> yeah.